Aren't you in a good mood right now? You hear this music and you feel good with hits like Conga and Rhythm is Gonna Get You. Their music is iconic. Their love story is one of a kind, so it's only fitting that Gloria and Emilio Estefan are putting the two together in On Your Feet, a Broadway musical about their lives, their loves, their careers. How thrilling is this? Oh my gosh, are I'm, you bes busting? I'm beside myself. I'm actually <laughs> sitting where he is right now. I'm thrilled. Now, whose you? idea was this to put this, on, you know, turn it into sort of a Broadway show? You know, 20 years ago, they came to us, and, and I, I saw at the time it was not the right timing. I think it's a great timing now. To, I think our, our lives can, can inspire a lot of people about dreams, about, you know, being persistent, and I think it's a great time. Your to love that. story is amazing. He was your first boyfriend. He was. Oh, I love it. <laughs> not anymore. No. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> so 37 years of marriage. So yes. was it love at first sight? Are we gonna together. are we gonna see this on uh, the stage? You're gonna see the whole breakdown. We don't believe in love at first sight. You can have lust at first sight. Lust but, at first I sight. Think. Okay. But, uh, it took a while. He had a he had an older girlfriend when I met him actually, and I was very innocent. I was 17 years That's old. That's not in the play. That's not the play. <laughs> You get no, some exclusive here. You, you'll get to see uh, how it happened. I had a lot of respect for me with my boss, and I looked at him as, whoa, you know, like this, this right. older guy. He's only four years older than you me. You think he'll think change? Now she's my boss. Yeah, <laughs> yeah like how it works. Picking the songs had to be difficult because every time you hear a song, you say, that one's got to be in, that one's got to be in, that one's got to be in. Yeah. How'd you guys narrow it down? You know what? It, some are no brainers. Uh, the, the key is that you're doing a show where, on a, in a musical, the music is what advances the story. Yeah. And the way that Alex Dinelaris, uh, our writer who won Golden Globes and Oscars Hello. for Goodman, yes, he did a phenomenal job. It seems they were written for the story, and my friends go, hey, you wrote them, it's your life. I go, yeah, but the way that he uses the music is, different way. is, is there, incredible. Is there going to be dancing? Like at Mamma Mia, people jump up and start uh, dancing. I sure hope so, they better. <laughs> and I heard a rumor, I don't know if this is true, that there will be beverages served. Of course. Uh, what are you talking about? Like, mojitos. what do you mean? We're going to have all these part time mojitos. I mean, it's going to be great. We got the Cuban thing have... going from Hello. the beginning of the show. <laughs> so get ready. And there are some sh Broadway shows where they actually walk drinks around and sell them while you're sitting there. Well, I don't know if that's going to happen. Well, you never, look, there's precedent for <laughs> that. That's good. Idea. <laughs> now, here's what's exciting. You had to wonder, like, who was going to play you? Did you guys have any role in the casting, or did you just uh, say who do you course. have? Of course. No, no. We, we let the director do his job, Jerry Mitchell, amazing uh, award winning director. Uh, but obviously, it you know, we had to have some kind of relationship well, or something. We're going to do a them. big reveal. Okay. This is happening on the Today Show. Right now. We are going to reveal the two actors, singers, dancers playing you two. We have Josh Segura. Come on out, Josh. And Anna Villafagne. Yes, Anna Villafagne. Now, Anna, I should say, you have been a Gloria fan forever, right? Yes, for as long as I can remember, actually. Did you sing her songs, hold the hairbrush and all that? 100%. I actually grew up performing her songs at talent shows and stuff like that, and uh, and I actually went to her high school. What? Yes, <laughs> she did. She's a Lord's so, yeah. girl. And Josh, you're a big fan of Huge Emilio, fan. obviously. Yeah. Do you do, let me hear a little impression. Teeny oh, one. Uh, Teeny one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't right. kill me, man. I'll there tell you, you I've never heard anybody say, babe. That's <laughs> cool. Babe. 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 Come on, babe. Babe. Uh, it's awesome. So where, where are you guys starting? In Chicago? Is that where it's starting? We're starting previews in Chicago, Chicago. on June 2nd, okay. and then we'll have previews in October here and November 5th. And we're starting ticket sales today. Yes, we are. Yes. My lucky 13. I want to say congrats to you guys. You know it's going to be great. I can't wait to see it. And thank you for doing this because you don't know the pressure of trying to keep this under wraps. It's like crazy. You're free. Again, on your yes. debuts on Broadway, October 5th. Tickets are available today.